All right now if you're someone who would love to listen to music or media on your phone speaker here's a very interesting feature which is currently available on Pixel phones and I really wish this feature lands on the other phones as well let me show you what I'm talking about let me open settings I'll tap on sound and vibration now here you see we have an option called adaptive sound now this feature was there a few months or a year ago on pixel phones but then for some reason google removed it that is what i got to know when i was reading some articles on the web then when i installed the qpr beta recently after the one ui 13 stable release i was able to see this feature on this beta version by the way if you're interested in knowing what is qpr beta i made a separate video on that i'll link it up in the description go ahead and check that video out now coming to this feature let me tap on adaptive sound. As you can see, it says adaptive sound improves sound quality from your phone speaker. It uses the microphone to assess the acoustics near you, then adjust the sound equalizer settings for your environment. This is what it does. And then it says adaptive sound may be less noticeable at higher volumes. All microphone audio is deleted shortly after it's recorded. It's processed locally and never leaves your device. Audio and background conversations are never sent to Google. So this means for this feature to work, the phone is going to record some audio through its microphone. It needs to understand the environment where you are sitting in. The AI will assess the acoustics and it improves the sound quality from the phone speaker. As you can see on this animation, it is showing you different environments. It is showing the bedroom, it is showing the kitchen, it is showing the bathroom as well. So depending on where you are using the phone, this feature is going to tune your phone speaker output. That sounds very interesting, isn't it? Now, I did try using this feature even at the lower level as they have mentioned here in this explanation. I am not able to see too much of a difference. I can see there is a slight shift in the audio and there is a slight improvement, but not that noticeable. I think this feature will be improved in the coming days and uh, this will be rolled out to maybe many other phones as well in probably the upcoming Android version. Let's wait and see that. But this is certainly a very interesting feature. If this feature really improves and offers a better speaker output depending on the environment, I'm sure you're going to love using it. I really hope this feature comes to the Samsung Galaxy phones and many other brands as well. You let me know what do you think about this feature? Do you really think it's going to be useful? Would you see yourself using this feature if at all you get it on your phone? Drop a comment and if you are someone who would love to know your phone better then this is the channel you should subscribe to. Go ahead and smash that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you see any value in this content. That's about it. That's all I want to share with you guys. Thanks for watching. My name is Salyan signing off. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye. Thank you.